Uh, okay. So yeah. <laughs> Whoa. Oh Jesus Christ, okay. What the ah. Well okay, let's try to get there. The are prime. You've got thirty minutes before this place blows. Move. All oh, right, they're about to explode. All this weird factory. Oh no, no. Ah. Okay, let's try this again. I'm not sure. I think I just no need. Yeah. I will better just look there. The fuses are primed. You've got 30 minutes before this place blows. Move. <laughs> I never believed in this shit, you know, like don't look down and everything will be fine, I don't know. I, I always feel myself very uncomfortable when there is some Fuck. Yeah. Some deep. Yeah, you, no, no, no. Well, when we are standing on some very high place. Oh, come on. Jesus Christ. Yeah, okay. Okay. Well, there is plenty of gold. Whoa. Okay. Need to be careful here. Uh. Yeah, okay. I'm good. Oh. Sanity loss can be controlled by avoiding traumatic city. Uh. Well, nothing new, anyway. What about Amo? Uh, well, plenty of everything, but um, you know what? Uh, what is the problem? I don't remember what is going to be next. In fact, I don't even remember what we are going to do now. It's a secret gold vault. This must be where the marshes hoard their wealth. Whoa! I won't be able to get through this way. Um, okay then. Okay, can't see anything useful here. Um, no, it doesn't look good here. Okay, looks like this is the only option. Uh, well, okay, I don't want to spend time on uh, exploring. Because it is going to be really... ...boring. Okay. The door is bolted shut. Hmm. Oh, this shit again. Oh. This pressure valve controls the flow of gas. What about another one? It's a valve for controlling the flow of gas. Uh, okay. So obviously we won't get through while this shit is working. Yeah. I 
can't turn the bolt with my bare hands. Ah, oh my god, dude, if only you were able to run. <laughs> it would be very awesome. It would save like 30% of my time. Oh my god. One of these box would be enough for me, I think. In fact, one of these piece would be enough, I guess. Nothing, nothing, nothing. Oh, okay. Okay, now I know this place, and here, uh, nothing useful, yeah. Oh, Jesus Christ. <sighs> ah. Okay. No. Oh. Okay, dude, are you, are you okay? Yeah, we, we are okay. Nice. Oh. The body's cold. He must have been dead for some time. What the hell is wrong with him? The body's cold. He won't need this anymore. What do we have? I'm wondering why why do we need this? Oh, maybe this is like sanity potion and amnesia. That means I need to use it manually, I guess. Okay, now I suppose... We need to open all these um, valves. Yeah. Oh wait, but now I'm not able to get back. Well, actually, I'm able, but only through there again. Well, it's a valve for controlling the flow of gas. Okay. Open. Nice. Uh, open. Nice, nice, nice. Okay. Uh, now again is boring. Way down. Yeah. 
And the last one. It won't open. Okay. Okay. Okay, now let's get back. Because I think I remember what will be next. There will be explosion. Um no, 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 no. Yes. So what next? It won't budge. Okay, as I said, I don't want to spend time on exploring, so let's... Yeah. Let's continue. Um... Nah, I won't shoot. No. I'm not th that curious. Oh. Now that's interesting. Oh, whoa. Whoa, whoa, whoa. I remember this part, fuck. We need to very quickly, very quickly. If sanity drops too low, we will commit a suicide. Oh, you goober again. At last, we found you. It's nice of you fellas to show up. What the hell is this place? It's some sort of shrine. Probably used by the marshes for private worship. And the oversized gargoyle? That's no gargoyle, Agent. That's Cthulhu. Fellas, this chamber's about to be buried under four floors of brick and metal. Okay, Walters, let's get out of here before this place blows. The order of Dagon. Night, that was one big explosion in the refinery. Uh, one moment I was running for my life, the next I was face down with a mouthful of dirt. 
I just hope everything inside was destroyed. What the hell was that thing in there? Some kind of monster jellyfish? How could it move out of water? How could it even exist? My ears are still ringing with the screams of hoovers men as the acidic slam and engulfed them. Despite the casualties, uh, though, the raid he, uh, hit pay dirt. The feds recovered a briefcase with some very incriminating papers. It seems that among other things, the Marsh family, Sebastian in particular, has been trafficking with enemies of the state. He's been offering a contagion, some kind of gem weapon, to the highest bidder. This is in violation of all kinds of international treaties. But that didn't surprise me. Even if the Marshes care about such things, which I doubt, I could well believe that news of the treaties hadn't even reached its mouth. But I know there is more to the story, like that shrine on the lower floor of the refinery. The carvings of those hideous gods are one more thing that will probably haunt my dreams for some time to come. Why did they seem familiar? In any case, the evidence of arms dealing gave Hoover what he needed to bring the big guns, literally. Its mouth is now under martial law. A coast guard cutter is stationed in the harbor with a company of marines on shore. Led by Robert Marsh, the surviving members of the esoteric order of Dagon are holed up in the old Masonic hall. I suggested pounding the place to dust with the marines' artillery and the cutter's gun, but who wants Marsh alive? That's not going to be easy, the marines who attacked the main entrance to the building went into some kind of psychotic seizure before they could reach it. The breath thought Marsh had laid down some kind of gas in the area, but gas mask didn't help the second storming party. That was when Hoover remembered the report of an old smuggler's tunnel close by the banks of the Manoxeta River. It was said to lead into the building from below. It seems my good luck just never ends. With so many agents killed and wounded in the refinery, Hoover has decided that I'll have the dubious honor of representing the FBI in an attack through this secret entrance, in company with a squad of marines. I have to meet up with Sergeant Carter and his men by the refinery gates, then we'll set out along the frozen river, looking for the tunnel. I may never sleep again. Now that it would make much a difference. The waking sounds and visions are getting worse all the time. So if they are linked with the events here in Innsmouth, maybe getting to the bottom of its horror will help me recover my lost memories. Uh, okay, maybe now I will uh, remember what is going to be next. I remember the level with the ship, but I, if I'm not mistaken, it will be in, in the end. Have your men been able to determine the location of this old smuggling route? Not yet. Our intelligence estimates the most likely site would be further downstream. The Manutsit is frozen over, so we should be just fine on foot. Let's get moving. Move out, Marine! Oh, yeah. Secure the area. I remember. I died several times here. Okay, never mind. Um, where am I going? I just came from the refinery. Ah, okay. <laughs> sorry, sorry. Oh, nice, nice. Have your men been able to? Oh, come on, to do all over again. Route? Not yet. Our intelligence estimates the most likely site would be further downstream. 
The Manutsit is frozen over, so we should be just fine on foot. Let's get moving. Okay. Move out, Marines! Uh. Secure the area. Yes, sir! You heard the man. Move out. Hi, you take the one. Okay, anyway, I'll just stop here. Um, so, yeah. We'll play a little further to the moment when I died, and then we'll continue. Thanks for watching.